guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing amazing i am doing good today i'm going to be sharing with you guys three ways that i always get myself together and look put together before i step out of the house it's important to me to always look put together so that my confidence can be at an all-time high <laughs> first thing that I do is I have to smell good like if I smell good even if I'm wearing sweats I feel like I'm put together so I always love to wear a really nice fragrance and I like the dossier fragrance a whole lot because they are smell like the expensive fragrances with a fraction of the price so the first one that I have is called floral pear it has some notes of bergamot and pear and watermelon and rhubarb and woodsy notes and musk and amber. And then the second one that I have is actually really exciting. This is a men's fragrance. I got this for Chris. This would be a great gift for a boyfriend, husband, brother for Valentine's Day. This one is the Fouge Oud. I hope I'm saying that right. And um, it has notes of rosewood, tobacco, pink pear, pink pepper, I'm sorry, coriander. I'm going to share a little tip that works really well for me with you guys. Um, I put my fragrance on before I get dressed just because it has Time to kind of warm up with my body temperature and really smells good by the time that I'm done getting dressed I also don't like to spray my fragrance on my clothes because if I spray it on my clothes it lasts and if I'm going out again and I'm wearing the same jacket then the jacket smells like the previous fragrance you know what I'm saying yeah The second thing that's the most important to me is actually putting on some makeup. You will be surprised at what a little bit of eyebrows and some lip gloss can do and some mascara. So I'm going very minimal and some of you are probably thinking this is not minimal, but for me, this is very minimal. I feel like I have my brows on and then I put on a little bit of corrector. I have some dark circles. So I'm using a little bit of a corrector to go ahead and get rid of the dark circles so I look awake. I feel like if you look awake, you look present and it makes you look more put together. You definitely don't have to wear foundation to look put together, but I do feel like you need something to even your skin out. Unless you were born with just naturally even skin, then you go girl, okay? But I wasn't, so I need something to even out my skin I'm using a concealer I'm using just a bit of concealer I know I'm saying a bit and I'm applying a lot but this just helps me even out the skin without applying too much product on I like to go ahead and set everything with a bit of powder foundation which I've already done and as you see here I'm just bronzing my face just a little bit I do a little bit of bronzer a little bit of blush a little bit of highlighter and that's it for the face really This part is completely optional. If you were blessed with long lashes, girl, just coat them with mascara. I wasn't. So I'm using my lashes and also my lipsticks from my beauty line, Benjamin Beauty. And I'm using those um, on. And these are my favorite, like, everyday colors and lashes. My hair is very important and before I leave the house, I just like to make sure it's put together. It doesn't have to be anything special. This is just a wig. I straightened it and then I put a few curls in the front just to kind of frame my face a little bit and give a little, you know, that little zhuzh. And then after that, we're going to move into our clothing. I like to stay very simple. You can literally do this combination whichever way you want and it turns out amazing every single time a white t-shirt okay you need white t-shirts in your life i own about 30 of them <laughs> i get them all from target but a white t-shirt with jeans or with pants or with leather leggings or with leather pants you can do whatever combination works well for you but just a white t-shirt and then you put on your jeans it looks amazing every single time and it looks simple I love to pair it with a pair of booties like this. Um, they're very comfortable. I can be on these all day and my feet won't hurt. Um, but they look really, really cute. I also do like a pointed toe. I feel like if you, especially if you're a shorter girl, a pointed toe boot is going to go a, a long way. Next, I throw on a jacket. You can do a blazer. 
if you're wearing jeans, I love a, a, a leather jacket like this, but if I was wearing more dress pants or if I was wearing more like leather leggings, I would throw on a cute white black blazer. I would add some pictures in here of some other uh, times that I've done this style so you guys can see. A hat, you can't go wrong. I mean, you don't have to do a hat, but I'm really into these hats lately. I feel like it just really completes the look. That's the whole entire look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I cannot wait to see you in my next one. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up, and I will see you soon. Bye.